unless he's being uh, uh, dishonest. Uh, I think the signs point toward the use of military force. And uh, incidentally, everybody who knows George Bush says he means what he says. And uh, what he has said leads almost inexorably to the conclusion that once uh, the futility of this diplomatic dance uh, is exposed for all to see, and once it is clear that there's no alternative to military force, I think he will he will use military force just as he did in Iraq uh, when the futility of the negotiations w was exposed. Let me ask you about values. Do you believe that, that it is America's duty, its obligation, not just to take on its enemies in this fourth world war, but to export the values of freedom, human rights, democracy? Mm -hmm. Isn't that working? Yes. Uh, I do. Uh, again, in, again, in the I, context of Abu yeah, Ghraib, Guantanamo Bay. Yeah. Well, I, I mean, Abu Ghraib, again, is wildly exaggerated. On a scale of 1 to 10, uh, I would put it down at about 0. 0.5. Uh, nobody got killed there. Uh, there were humiliations. The well, people, the people who inflicted, the people, the people, the people who inflicted. Well, you brought it up. Let me just say, the people who inflicted those humiliations uh, are being punished, and uh, uh, I, I think to uh, to elevate Abu Ghraib to the status of the Gulag has some. Well, I, I'm it's not monster. elevating Abu Ghraib well, at all, but I would like to ask you about something you said to the Wall Street Journal on August mm -hmm. the 12th. You said, and I'm quoting. The only reason we're having as much trouble in Iraq as we're having is that we're not getting intelligence. You mm -hmm. can only get that kind mm -hmm. of intelligence by, in italics, squeezing mm -hmm. it out of them. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. That's just basic support for torture, isn't it? On the contrary. Uh, squeezing. Well, it seems to me that you are, you, uh, you are people who think as you appear to think, are defining torture down to the point where it will be, def it will be considered torture if you ask somebody his name. 